Another day, another metric. Welcome back to Digital Analytics, the channel for marketing, e-commerce, and data analysis of your digital marketing spend. Today, we calculate expense to revenue ratio and learn more why this is important. The advertising to sales ratio is a great way for an e-commerce website to track the effectiveness of your marketing and advertising spend. The formula is a pretty simple, and usually these numbers are available either from your financial statements or inside your actual advertising platforms. It is marketing cost or advertising cost total divided by revenue. So in this example, $100 in marketing cost and if your revenue was $500 in total revenue, that would be a, an expense to revenue ratio of 0.2 or 20%. And the key factors that you're looking at when why the expense to ratio is important is you want to watch your yearly trends to see if it's going up or down. If your number is going up, that means it's hurting your profitability. You're not being as efficient with your advertising spend. Also, you want to keep a look at your overall revenue because if your number is holding steady, it means that you possibility that you could be, if you spent more on advertising or marketing, you could increase your total revenue. So you do want to keep an eye on the year over year trend. And those are some of the key factors in your advertising to sales ratio. The expense to revenue ratio. This can be calculated for either your entire marketing spend or your advertising spend, depending on if you're taking a look at it from a company-wide level. For a company, it basically measures how much they spend in order to make a dollar in revenue. And if you're looking at it from a marketing standpoint, you wanna spend how much are you spending on your marketing or advertising in order to get that dollar of revenue. It does analyze the effectiveness of your marketing and one of the things you do want to keep an eye on is how is it trending year over year. This is kind of one that you take a look at on an annual basis because if it's trending down or up, it may be impacting your bottom line. If a ratio is going up, it impacts your bottom line. It means less profitability. And if it's going down, and even though your revenue is going up, it may mean that you should be spending more money, you're leaving some money on the table, you should be spending more money on your marketing and advertising to grow revenues each more. So it's not necessarily a matter of watching the trend line go down. You do want to look at it in terms of your total revenue of your company as well. Remember, that's a look at your expense to revenue ratio. Hit subscribe, ring that bell for notification, or you can leave a comment on a metric that you would like explained next. And that's a wrap on another edition of Digital Analytics.